complaints very seriously. Now, which one of you would like to start? <laughs> Sabrina, how about you? Um, yeah, fine. So I used to think Ubers were so cool. They were new, they were sexy, they were so clean. And like now they're just so like disgusting. Hmm, um, was there anything in particular? Well, I just hate when they smell like smoke, you know? Like, the other day, this driver had the nerve to smoke right in front of me. And I was just like, <laughs> and he just turned up the music and drowned me out. Oh, dear, that is rude, yeah. That is indeed unfortunate. We definitely want to make cleanliness a point of emphasis. Now, Cal, would you like to share your complaint? Oh, well, gee, I don't want to be a bother. Oh, nonsense. Everyone has a voice here. Oh, okay, if you say so. Uh, so, uh, one time, uh, I was just waiting for my Uber, you know, like I do sometimes, and then a big truck pulls up, and I check my phone, and I ask the driver, hey, are you Dave? And he says, lucky guess, what's it to you? So I said, well, you're supposed to give me a ride, silly. And he says, well, where to? And I said, well, to the airport, if it pleases you. And he says, well, that's where I'm going. So I said, all right, okay. And then I got in. And then, well, it took quite a while, and we were kind of late. Yeah, but my Uber is always late. Like, we'll be on track to get there, and then all of a sudden, the fucking driver misses an exit. Oh, yeah, that's a shame. Yeah, yeah um, <laughs> we're sorry about that. Um, Uber will typically refund you. You better. If your driver takes us up Optimo route. Um, well, Cal, I feel like you might have been cut off. Would you like to continue? Uh, okay, sure. Um, <laughs> well, another thing was, it was really cold that day. And Dave's truck was missing a whole door. <laughs> yeah, I was freezing. So I just think that as company policy, all Ubers should have all their doors. <laughs> oh boy, say what? That reminds me of this one car where the door was just so dented, I could hardly get it open and shut. Like, talk about a safety risk. Yeah, well, we're sorry about that. I'm sure your driver was punished and got his door repaired. But again, I want to go back to Cal. You're your story just baffles me. Uh, okay. Uh, so another thing was, he sure pulled over a lot. Usually when I go to the airport, it takes me 45 minutes, you know, on the highway. But no, he took all the side roads. He went back and forth and back and forth, and I swear, he might have stopped at, well, excuse my language, man, but darn near every building. Some drivers make so many dumb turns, like my Uber will say, oh, I'm three minutes away, and then t turns on Lower Wacker. Yeah, yeah, I'm sorry about that. But, but Cal, why was he stopping? Like, were you in a pool by any chance? Did other people ride along with you? Uh, yeah, I didn't think it was, but it might have been. You guys sure are pushing that Uber pool service thingy. <laughs> nope, just me and Dave, though. No one else. This behavior is very strange. Mm -hmm. Did you try asking him what he was doing? Well, he wasn't very easy to talk to. I did try saying to him once, Hey Dave, would you mind turning around and going back to the airport like you said you would? And he just said, Shut it. We got a schedule to keep to, and we're going to get there when I say so. Oh, uh, I know, right? They are so... Yeah. Sabrina, chill. Um, Cal, please continue. Oh, uh, well, I guess the end of it was. It, it took quite a while, but like I said, we got to the airport. And when we were getting close, I said, Hey Dave, would you drop me off by United? And he said, No, we're late. We're going straight to the plane. So I thought for a second, yeah, 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 plane. I thought for a second, golly, oh, that's great service, Dave, dropping me off of my plane like that, past security and everything. But no, it was the wrong plane. And then unbeknownst to me, me and those boxes wound up in Kentucky, and that was a bummer. So, Kentucky? Yeah, so yeah, thanks a lot, Uber. Um, Cal, a couple of times you mentioned that he was driving a truck. That's unusual because Uber doesn't typically import trucks. Can you describe the vehicle a little bit more? Yeah, yeah, like I said, it was really big. It was a big truck. Yeah. Um, it had a whole door missing. You can't miss that. But yeah, I guess it was just a big brown truck. You have got to be kidding me. Oh my god. <laughs> what? Cal, sweetie, that was UPS. Huh? Cal, quit dialing. We gotta finish our route. Oh, sorry guys, gotta run my Ubers here.